Hi everyone, welcome to Statistics Bios on YouTube channel. I am Mohan Atanari. Today we will discuss topic how to draw a PCA graph in past statistical software. The data already entered in the Excel sheet. The first one for the water sample locations. Then uh, next one for the environmental water parameter. The PCF 1, 2, 3 is a same water sample but collected different locations 1 and 2, 3. Then all, that also the same method collected the water samples. Then the uh, environmental water parameter first one for the pH, salinity, DO, EC, DDS, temperature, alkalinity and turbidity. This data copy paste to the past statistical software. The data copy, copy, then go to the past statistical software. The data already entered. So first click the column attributed, then row attributed. Select the zero column, then paste the data. Then color change for the group for the PCF 1, 2, 3, the same color, and the PC, uh, FRB 1, 2, 3, the next one color. The third one for the CRY 1, 2, 3 is a uh, different color. The next one shows color for the RTU 1 and 2, the same color. Then AWQ 1, 2, 3, the different color. Then unclick for the column attributed and row attributed. Then select the data. Go to the multivariated menu. Click the ordination and the click the principal compound analysis. This is for the principal compound analysis tab. The just matrix value click the correlation. The click the recomputing button. The equivalent value for the 4 point highest value in the 4.28931. And variation percentage in the highest percentage value for the principal compound analysis 1 53.616. Then next one for the scatter plot for the principal compound analysis graph. Just the graph for the click the by plot checkbox. The dry a environmental water parameter, the temperature, salinity, alkalinity, turbidity, pH, DDS, DO, and EC. And then next one row label the click the checkbox the row label for the water sample parameter then x1 for the principal compound analysis 1 this is a principal compound analysis 1 then next one for the principal compound analysis 2 the principal compound analysis 2 for the y axis the principal compound analysis 1 is a x axis the change for the uh, principal compound analysis 1 2 3 4 5 6 first one for the the correlation for the positively presented in the temperature, salinity and EC. The negative correlated for the alkalinity, turbidity, pH, the DDS and DO. The score value for the scatter plot, the first one for the PCF123, the principal compound analysis one, the negative correlated and the principal compound analysis two, the positive correlated. PCF123. The PCF 1, 2 and then negatively correlated for the DO and positively correlated for the EC. The principal compound analysis 2. Then next one value for the FBR. The FBR the first principal compound analysis is positive. The next principal compound analysis 2 is a negative correlated FBR. The FBR value the present the first one for the positively correlated in the turbidity and the salinity. Then uh, negatively correlated for the alkalinity, turbidity and pH. Then third one for the CRY 1, 2 and 3. Then negatively correlated in the principal compound analysis 1 and the principal compound analysis 2 the positively correlated. The same also the 3, the PC1 the negative and the PC3 for the positive, the PC4 for the negative, PC5 is a positive and the PC6 is a negative and the PC7 for the CRY the positive, the PC8 for the positive in the CRY. Then next one for the RTU 1, 2 and 3, the principal compound the first one the positive and the second also the positive. The RTU, the first the positive for the correlation, the temperature and the salinity, that also the EC also positive correlated. The next one for the two value, the principal compound is 2 and 1, also the negatively correlated for the AWQ 1 and 2 and the 3. The negative value for minus 1.0425. The AWQ, the negatively correlated first value for the score value, principal compound analysis 1, the uh, 1.04, the A point for the 
the next the two point for the minus two point three seven four minus two point three seven four for the principal compound analysis two. This is a principal compound analysis one. This is a principal compound analysis two. The next one for the loaded scatter plot. Before we check the uh, scatter plot change for the axis, it's principal compound analysis one. The comparison for the two, the axis also same P, uh, PC2, PC2 the scatter plot. Then next one for the change the XH value, the PC3, principal compound analysis 3 and the principal compound analysis 4 and the principal compound analysis 5. The principal compound analysis 5, XH and the principal compound analysis Y is a 2. Then value for the first one for the RTU 1, 2, then this chamber, the different chamber for the RTU 3. Then next one for the loading plot. The loading plot for the positively correlated PC1. The PC1 click the value for the correlation. The component for the principal compound analysis. The positively present the pH salinity and temperature alkalinity and turbidity. The negatively presented in the DO, EC and DDS. The loading plot value for the next, next slide. The loading plot for the first one for the principal compound analysis pH salinity value 1.0 uh, 1, uh, 0.41 the pH is 0 0.41 the next one for the salinity 0 0.76 0 point value for the 76 the next value for the negatively correlated for the DO EC and DDS the negative correlated DO the value 0 0.93 the EC 0 0.65 and DDS 0 0.064 0 0.064 then positively correlated for the tem temperature alkalinity and the turbidity the positively correlated for the turbidity and the next one for the principal compound analysis 2 the first one for the pH negative correlated change for compound for principal compound analysis the first one for the pH is a negative correlated the score value for the minus 0.19389 then next one for the salinity and the EC and the temperature also the positive correlation the PC2. The negatively correlated for the pH, DO, TDS, alkinity and turbidity is a negative correlated. Next one the for the scatter plot. This is a scatter plot. Next one for the test for the bottless PST test. The bottless sphere test is test for the determination value 3.0082 e to the power minus 0 pi. This is a numeric uh, scientific value, convert for the numeric value. This is link mentioned for the description box. Converter, online converter. Enter the value, scientific value 3.0082 minus small e, enter the small e minus 0 pi. Click the calculated. The determinant value for the 0 0.403002. The next one for the high square test value 109.32. The difference of freedom 28. The next one p value for the p value. Go to the back. Enter the scientific value 1.4842 enter the small letter e to the power minus 11. Click the calculate button. The value 0 0.10014842 the statistically significant. Then next one test for the higher mayor, higher mayor Volkin test, the measurement. The Hulken Mayer Volkin measurement. Then KMO, the measurement value for 0 0.6173. Then next one for the 3D scatter plot. The click the by plot. The this is a 3D graph for the scatter plot. The movement graph for the adjustment. 90 degree, 40, 20, 30. This is adjustment for the 3D scatter plot in principal compound analysis adjustment for the graph in the principal compound analysis 
Thank you for watching this video. If you like our channel, please click the subscribe button.